there, it's Perry with Paper Crafting Threads. Today, I have a fun post-it note holder with the June 2023 Paper Pumpkin Kit. Welcome in. Let's get started. I'm taking one of the card bases and cutting it down to three and one eighths by seven three quarters inches. Then score at one inch, one and a quarter inches, four and three eighths inches, and four and five eighths inches. Fold and burnish the score lines just made. Ignore the crease that was there originally. Take one of the Knight of Navy cardstock bases and cut two squares, three and one eighths by three and one eighths, and one strip, one inch by three and one eighths inch. Ink and stamp the floral vine image in Knight of Navy ink on one of the squares and the strip. Adhere the strip and the two squares on the inside of the holder as shown. After splitting a sticky notepad in half, I inked up my sentiment and stamped it on the top sheet. Then I stamped the flower image repeatedly, moving it slightly each time to make a flip book. Add adhesive to the back of the pad and adhere it to the middle of the holder. I wrapped one of the flirty flamingo banners from the kit from the inside of the holder around to the front. To add more dimension to the poppy image from the kit, I used Flirty Flamingo, Daffodil Delight, and Old Olive watercolor pencils. I used a pencil to mark where I wanted to trim the label. Using more parts from the kit, I popped up the sentiment strip on the yellow trimmed die cut. I used thin clear Velcro circle fasteners, being sure to put the clear circle on the back of the front flap. Scatter some Knight of Navy dots. And there you have it, a sticky note holder with a hidden flip book. And here's another version with the other half of the sticky notepad. I alternated corners with the flower image this time. Find written instructions over on my blog at If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Bye!